Civil War's Battle of Franklin happened right here on the doorstep of Lotes House, and today we're going to step back in time to 1864 with admission to this museum. I'm going to introduce you to your host and hostess today by proxy. Johann Albert Lotz and Margaretha Lotz. Johann was a master woodworker, craftsman, and carpenter. Johann Albert Lotz made musical instruments like violins, dulcimers, guitars, and pianos, and made furniture like the couch you're welcome to sit on. The guides here are so passionate, and they're telling you all about the history of the house, but also the history of what happened here. November 30th, 1864 was a very sad day for the Lopes family. And of course, when the battle begins at 4 p.m., this little family, 75% of the home was damaged or destroyed. This is a man, Mr. Lotz, who's a German immigrant. He does not have a dog in this fight. He is a non-combatant. He's a non-slaveholder. He just happens to build front row, 50 yard long, from what many scholarly historians call the bloodiest five hours of the American Civil War. Over the years, they have found a ton of bullets and shells just around the yard. It's one of the dozen that we dug up in our front yard 15 years ago. Six pound solid shot Confederate cannonball. It crashes through the roof, second floor, and comes to rest there. What an engaging tour. I love being wrapped up in the story with such a passionate tour guide. It's been a great way to learn a little bit about an important piece of history.